Let's finish our discussion about the steps for designing and managing experiences by discussing the management of experiences over time. Remember, as we keep saying over and over again, most products can be turned into experiential products. You just need to identify the core experience, design the experience, stage the experience, and then be willing to manage that experience over time to, of course, not only continuously improve it, but to identify any issues that may have come up over time. <clears throat> we manage the experience over time by using feedback to continually improve the experience. The first question we need to identify and we need to do in, in, in an experience audit is um, find out in terms of the foundational ex um, experiences that we are providing, what is working, what is not working, what are we missing, and even perhaps what do we have involved that we could in fact eliminate and spend that time and effort on something else. Uh, when we think about managing experiences over time, the first thing we ought to be thinking about enhancements. That is, how do we enhance the experience over time? Well, while we're going to spend some, some time on this um, at a later date, it's important to identify the types of enhancements that exist. It could be a performance enhancement. So certain products are designed where the experience is um, the, the, the thrill you get from the performance uh, of, the, uh, of, the, uh, of, the, of the product in the experience. So we need to be able to identify how we might enhance the performance experience. We also might figure out how we enhance the entertainment experience. We also might try to find enhancements to make the experience more interactive or more educational or even make it more emotional than it currently is. We might look at enhancements that create more mental stimulation, that is more thinking on the part of the individual involved in the experience, or maybe more physical stimulation. All right, so when we think about managing the experience over time, we need to balance between enhancing the experience and preserving the core experience. So sometimes a restaurant will decide that they need to overhaul the experience, and they'll change a bunch of the items, a bunch of the uh, things in the experience. And what happens is they might actually lose or, or decrease the original core experience. So this is that difficult balancing act behind continuously improving and preserving the, the aspects of the experience that everyone likes and, and, and finds valuable um, and immersing whenever they experience it. So uh, one of the things that we can think about are upgrades. How do we upgrade the experience? Yeah, you know, if it's a scary movie, how do we make the second movie scarier? How do we upgrade that? You know, if, uh, if our experience is, uh, is supposed to be emotional, how do we make it more emotional? The second aspect of managing experiences over time is the evolution. As culture changes, as expectations change, as... Um, as uh, needs change, the experience has to evolve, and it has to evolve over time. Third, sometimes the way to be successful at managing an experience over time is to go back to the basics. Go back to the original concept, and let's be true to what it was we started to do when this, when this all began. We also need to be worried about wear out. So wear out is what happens when you experience the, um, uh, when, when, you, when the individual experiences the event over and over again and eventually um, they get tired of the experience. An example of this, of course, is something like going to Disneyland. You know, you can buy an annual pass to go to Disneyland. You could go to Disneyland every day. But if those of you who have been to Disneyland a number of times know that the first time you go to Disneyland, it's fabulous. The second time, it's great. The third time, it's okay. The fourth time, it's okay. The fifth time, it's okay. Uh, the seventh and eighth time, it's actually starting to get a little bit routine and, and, and not as exciting as it was when we first started. 
That's the issue of wear out. And if we do have a wear out issue, we need to come up with solutions for that wear out issue. And, you know, and some of the solutions might be to add new things to the experience, try to enhance the experience to, to increase the performance, the entertainment, the interactiveness, the educational value, the emotional value, mental and physical stimulation. We also need to think about retraining the employees. As over time, the employees get sloppy with their performances and with their ability to satisfy customers uh, and create the right experience. And then, of course, finally, we need to be thinking about how we, if we're going to make changes, how do we go about implementing those changes in a way that doesn't detract from the current experience, but enhances future experiences. <clears throat> in summary, the steps to designing uh, and managing experiences is that experiences that offer functional benefits are not experiences, but rather services. So, you know, washing your car that has functional benefits of washing your car are in reality tied up in the service. But once you add some sort of an entertainment value uh, and other um, experiential aspects to the car wash, it becomes an experience. The key, once again, is that core experience. If you don't understand the core experience, it will be difficult for you to maximize it and manage it over time. Many lasting experiences are actually a series of experiences that keep evolving over time. The experience is when the customer is immersed in the moment. That's the true test of the experience. The way to avoid competition is to enhance the experience, not add services, but get to the core. It is very difficult to emulate or copy an experience. It's easy to copy added functional services. You need to understand that the customer decides how the experiences will unfold. You enhance the experience, but the customer goes through the process of determining exactly what the experience will be.